Game time. Yo, what is up? It's Conflict Contarian. I'm back in the lab with a response video this time. We're joining the party a little late on this map. I'm actually like 20 or 21 and 0 right now at this point on this map. And I was a goofball and forgot to turn my Elgato on. Ugh, come on. So you guys missed all the action. I'm, this is like a triple Talon and a couple hardened sentries on this map on a... Hunted, which is actually, I like it, a really good map. Anyways, I'm using the XR2 and Hardcore Kill Confirmed, you know, one of the best things. Thanks, Treyarch, for listening to us and actually adding that in. I like it. Look at me pick that guy out of the air. Anyways, like I was saying, it's a response vid. JA, Judgment Awaits, put out a video earlier um, talking about the laws of the Bible, or talking about God's laws in general, and how there are different types of laws. There were three things that he said. Um about the laws he, th he said that people perceive them as restrictive um, and then he said um, try to imagine without laws and then he also says that laws are good and guess what as being part of the four percent that i talked about in my last video and as jay being part of the four percent as i talked about in the last video i agree laws are good and i told him man I, hey man i've been thinking about this for the last couple weeks as well he said i've been thinking about it in a different way i've been thinking about it in butts that's right i said it butts talk about the biggest butts of the bible that's right i'm not talking about esther or ruth or eve i'm talking about b-u-t not a second t-s the biggest butts in the bible and this was one of them the first one in the Bible, the first but that we get in the Bible comes in Genesis. Genesis chapter 2, 16 and 17. It's the first law. It's the first rule. There was only one rule. It was, hey, God told Adam, hey, you can eat of any tree in the Bible. You can eat in the Bible. You can eat of any tree in the garden, but not that one. But not that one tree you can't eat of. And so we're talking about the fall of man here. And so when it comes to laws... And this one law, this one rule, I compared it to a fish bowl, or to a fish in his bowl. Try taking the fish out of the bowl, what's going to happen to him? We all know, fish is going to die. But within the bowl, within the parameters of his fish bowl, his environment is held together. He lives, he thrives. And that's kind of what God's laws with these rules that people seem to think Christianity is about, these rules of do's and don'ts. And that's not what it's all about. We'll get to that in, in following videos. But they're there to keep us safe. They're there to keep us so that we can thrive, so that we can't, we don't have to live in fear all the time, so that we can live free. I know it sounds weird, but God gave us laws. He gave us guidelines and principles to live by so that we could live free and not in fear. Like I said earlier, this led to the fall of man and to keep from matters getting worse. He did this to provide purpose, direction, and motivation. The Army Field Manual, FM 22-5, states that leadership is the art of leading men and women in order to accomplish a mission by providing purpose, direction, and motivation. And that's what our God did for us. He gave us, his people, these laws in order to provide these things for us. In the next vid, we're going to talk about another big butt of the Bible. We're going to talk about the redemption of man. We talked about the fall of man, the first big butt of the Bible. But in the next vid, we'll talk about the biggest butt of all, the redemption of mankind. I hope you guys enjoyed 36 and 6. That's all I got. Hasta luego, mis amigos.